Mzalana was born in Kiskamawuk in the Eastern Cape. His family says although he was in Cape Town, he kept the family ties strong. The news of his passing, friends, relatives, and those who worked with him have been visiting the Mladlana home to pay tribute. Uh, uh, in pay, uh, all families when they lose their loved ones uh, in pain, but we came here to do whatever we can do to express our condolences with the family. Mladlana was also a former teacher and school principal. And principal of Andile Primary School in Cape Town, where Mladlana served as principal, says he's expected to keep up with the high standard set by Mladlana. Especially of the parents whom back then were uh, and uh, 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 learners uh, at the time, they are expecting me to perform to, to even more than the level yeah, that, that, that he did at the school. Yes, it's big shoes to fill. So instrumental in the formation of the South African Democratic Teachers Union and became its founding president. It's a critical role in uniting the teachers in the 1980s, culminating in the formation of SATU as the first truly non-racial teacher union in 1990. The membership organ I mean, recognized his critical role when they elected him as the first president of SATU. The ANC also described him Lazana as a dedicated and disciplined member. One thing that made Common Martin distinct is that he never played to the gallery and criticized the ANC in public. I'm a ANC member of the ANC. I'm not a ANC member of the ANC. I'm not a ANC member of the his provincial memorial service was also attended by party veterans, including ministers Ngonde Balfo, Trevor Manuel, and Paolo Jordan. Retired Western Cape judge Siraj Desai was also present. Deputy President Paul Mashadile is expected to deliver a eulogy at Mzlazana's official memorial service. Lula Mamaja, SAPC News, Cape Town.